what's up guys and welcome to the tarot i am an energy and intuitive reader and i'm here to do the general reading for somebody so let's see who's gonna get it virgo what's up bergs thank you so much for being here i hope you guys are doing swell today all right so today i'm going to pull from my index cards and oracle deck clarify and give you some advice okay bottom of the deck is you can't know okay with luck is on your side not true and it's not a no it's change of perspective there's something that you can't know the whole answer to okay you want to know the you want to know the whole formula you can't all right you have to trust the process something is yours but you're not meant to know the ingredients right now. And that might drive you a little bit crazy, but don't worry. With not true here, I feel like you're you're telling yourself negative thoughts here. Okay, whatever you're telling yourself is not true. You need to stop, you need to release control, okay? And stop overthinking, okay? And change your perspective. I just feel like you're trying to dig, you're trying to find out. And, you know, you're not getting the answers you want because you're not meant to know. Okay, at least not at this time. You dealing with a Capricorn because they kind of had the same energy a little bit, not really. Okay. Let me shuffle these. Hot commodity. Are you a hot commodity, Virgo? I don't know. All right, the first card you have is 66, okay? So this is my card for your angels are talking. Are you listening? Your guides, your God, whoever you believe in, they're talking. Are you listening? Four of Michael. No, you not. Um, insights that come from quiet meditation, the need for sleep or time off, seek relief from stress. So some of you guys need to take a break right now so you, know, so you can hear what they're trying to tell you. Okay, some of you guys could be... Um, getting some time off from work okay or you kind of need to be kind of alone right now so the universe can kind of talk to you your spirit guides your angels like i said your god whoever you believe in what is the four of michael and 66 here you have the seven of cups in reverse the death card in reverse the five of swords and the ten of wands bottom of the deck is the star okay you who do with a scorpio and aquarius there's something you don't you're not even aware of there's something here that's not over okay and you're really in your head about it but it's not over but i feel like you're in your head about it but if you just like oh hold on um let me clarify some things because your wish like somebody's your wish someone's gonna come and give you your wish like what you truly want here i feel like if something wasn't working before but hold on um what is this ten of wands here Yes, you definitely ended something with somebody here. All right. Two of Cups in reverse, the Six of Cups, and the Ten of Swords. It kind of ended kind of badly here. But I feel like with the Six of Cups, there's... This person misses you. I also feel like... Like this person never really left or something. Like they were like always like lingering or something. Okay, what is the Death card in reverse? The lovers in reverse, the three of cups, and the five of wands. Someone definitely wants to reunite here. Um, what is this five of wands? The hierophant. Oh, they learned their lesson. They're not catty anymore. They're not argumentative anymore. It could be a Gemini. 
they've learned a lesson. Could be a Taurus. I like, I love to see the Hierophant or the Hermit. You could trust this. What is this Five of Swords? Why are you in your head? The Devil, because of negative thinking, the Chariot in reverse, and the Temperance. I mean, it's not negative thinking. You're just like, the universe stopped this, you know, like this stopped before. Like, why would I do it again? The world, wow. Because that chapter stopped, but there's another one starting. Or there's another one meant to start. The Empress is here. You deserve this. I feel this person is coming in with good intentions, the devil. But your negative energy, I mean, your negative thoughts are kind of... That's why the universe is like, yo, just go sit down somewhere real quick. Go sit down somewhere real quick. Refresh yourself, you know. Because um, I feel like this is actually good. This person is coming in to bring balance. So I feel like you should accept it. I don't know if y'all want to hear that, but I feel like you should. This feels good to me, so. You have free will, though. You know, you don't have to if you don't want to. But I think you should. All right. The next card you have is weights. Okay, so hold on a second before you do that. You have the Empress. Wow. Some of y'all want to have a baby? um time to act upon your plans creativity is rewarded luxurious or abundant resources hmm something's about to something is about to grow like a mother real quick here but or you guys or you're gonna fall in love real quick okay take it how it resonates but the universe is like hold on wait so let's see why they want you to wait what is the empress and wait yeah, the Wheel of Fortune in reverse, the Four of Pentacles in reverse, the Five of Cups in reverse, and the Sun in reverse with the Ten of Cups at the bottom of the deck. So you guys could definitely be growing your family or something like that. Um, now, now, whatever this is, right, this could be love or this could be, and it doesn't have to be love. It could be, you know, something material here, okay? You are definitely meant to make some type of change when it comes to your material life, okay? But that's why they're saying wait, because not only, okay, you're going to be, it's like, I don't want to say that. I don't feel like you're going to have a problem doing this, but I feel like you're going to have to let go of something. In order for you to obtain this. Um, what is this Four of Pentacles in reverse? The Chariot in reverse, the Temperance in reverse, and the Lovers in reverse. I mean, the, the universe wasn't wasn't really um, coinciding with this anyway. I feel like there was a lot of stop, start, stop, start, stop, start. I feel like you were the one that was more balanced in the situation. With whatever it is that you're letting go of. What is the chariot? I mean, the full of fortune. I feel like there's a... Yeah, there's, there's a party that's a little undecisive. Because, like, I feel like you have fun. Could be an Aries Leo Sag. I feel like you have fun, but it's not fated or destined for it to move past that. And I feel like you um having an upgrade to your um you know to your material life or having this upgrade in love is going to require you to let go of this situation that is really fun and whatever okay the five of cups is in reverse like i said i don't think like, i don't think like it's gonna like it's like a oh no I, yeah i don't think like it's like that you know i feel like you don't want to but you gonna have to. So the universe kind of saying, hey, just so you know, we, you have this beautiful thing here. Yeah, you're gonna start this beautiful thing. It's gonna grow amazing. Yeah, but just know you gotta take care of that too. <laughs> like, you know, because that could spill into this. And even if you're in this energy already, like, you know, the universe will cause challenges. Don't play with the universe because they'll, they'll bark back. They bite back. Trust. Trust. I'm sorry, I just they do so don't don't be don't be like oh well i'm gonna see i'm gonna just do my a okay you could do you that's fine you'll learn your lesson you know 
But anyway, let's keep going. The next card you have is it needed to be, it needed to happen like this. Is Mercury retrograde over? It needed to happen like this. Knights of Ariel. There is so much to accomplish. Make a very detailed plan being watched over someone kind. Listen, Virgo, I don't want to hear it. I, I don't want to hear it. You know, the Knight of Ariel, which is the Knight of Pentacles in the regular tarot, okay? I don't want to hear it. I feel like a lot of you guys are like, why is this moving like this? Why is this, like, there's so much I have to do. Yeah, because you were moving at a snail pace before, Virgs. You, the Knight of Ariel is, 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 the, is the slowest moving knight in the deck. I feel like whatever this is, you were dragging it out. I gotta be honest. For a very long time. And now you're going into the room that you haven't been in in forever because you've been dragging it, cleaning the room. And now you're seeing, wow, like all the dirt and all the whatever is really stuck on the floor. And I really gotta, yeah, of course, the longer you sit in a situation that you're not supposed to be in, the, the harder it's going to be to get out. And that is what's happening right now with you. So, you know, just get your gloves, get any extra Clorox. Google stuff, YouTube videos, figure it out. But don't be like, oh, this is too hard. I'm not, don't give up. Because you got yourself into this situation. You must get yourself out, birds. Okay, I've been there, done that. Been there, done that. Okay, I will no longer let that room get dirty. No longer, okay? Because it took forever to clean. <laughs> yeah, no. So just clean it. Just get to it. You know what I'm saying? The Eight of Cups in reverse, the Ten of Pentacles, the Seven of Wands in reverse, and the Knight of Cups with the Page of Swords. Um, first of all, I feel, I feel like, um, okay, you went back to this. That's why. In a way where, like, you started giving this attention again. You started, and that's why I started dragging out. The thing is that it's not like you went for it. I feel like the energy was like, hey, Bergs. And I feel like you were just like, okay, you know. I don't feel like, you know, you were really fighting for this. Like, you were, it's not like you were like, you know, this is a person. It's like you're like calling this person all the time. Like, hey, do you want to hang out? Hey, do you want to? Hey, do you want to? You weren't, you know. This person came and called you. Hey, let's, you're like, okay, you know. But uh, you still picked up, you know what I'm saying? You still went, you know what I'm saying? You still you still did it no matter which way it happened so you got to get yourself out that's just what it is yeah that's why i'm okay so that's what you got to remove yourself from you got to clean the room before you leave yeah well clean get get to it get to it you got a new beginning here you don't want to miss this opportunity i mean you can you have free will if you want to you know but i feel like a lot of you guys want this you know, just start cleaning the room. You know. That's it. The, the, the sooner you get the room clean, the sooner you can start your new beginning and get that out of your hair. You know what I'm saying? Alright, so let's get you some advice. If you're if you're with someone, your friends their friends could be watching you like if you have a social media or if you um you know do something like online or whatever like they watch you i don't get good vibes i feel like they're just like curious you know that's what it that's what it felt like okay what is the four of michael and 66 here you have venus and libra okay you could have your Venus in Libra. Oh, this could be about a Libra. Relationships, the beauty of, do it with your partners and. I know this card's a little, I know, okay. Um, so yeah, I feel like the universe is saying you guys are about to get in a relationship here with this person and they want you to work together with this person. They want you to do something with them. It could be like you guys both have to do the same thing. It's like do it together. Like this could be like you guys are both moving. Your, your lease is up at, the, at, like, at the same time. Or like maybe your lease is up like one month before the other person. I don't know. 
they're kind of insinuating you guys like building together okay definitely about love love is love is knocking love is knocking and they want you to open the door okay what is weight and empress Sheesh. you have mercury for gemini and virgo and um the sixth house okay um the awareness of many thoughts about or from many words okay I feel like you know that, um, you know, while you're cleaning the room, you know, um, people are going to have a lot to say. Let them, let them, let them, let them, it's okay. Let them talk. They, they, you can't, you can't control that. Let them talk. All right. Service to others. What is good for us and your work? I feel like, um. You got to do what's good for you. You're doing what's good for you. You're doing what's best for you. So anybody, any, you got any naysayers? Mm, sucks to be them, okay? I feel like you're doing something that's good for you, and that's that's all that matters here, okay? And I feel like people are hating on you now because you're finally doing something that, that, you know, maybe people are used to you always just catering to them and doing things for them, and now you do something for yourself, and it's like, oh my gosh, you see Virgo? Virgo's actually cleaning the closet. Yeah, well, you should clean your closet too. What is the night of Ariel and it needed to happen like this? You have um, Pisces energy. All right. Um, your dreams, your idealizations of be part of something overwhelming and. Your dreams are about to come true, bro. Period. I feel, I feel like you could be dreaming about this new beginning. Uh, but I feel like you're going to realize that like what you truly wanted is actually happening like physically um and it might be a little overwhelming you know but it's a beautiful thing okay i also feel like your spirituality is getting um it's getting a step up here you're trusting yourself more which is good um don't be indecisive right now okay make a choice and stick to it stick to your for to your first choice to your first thought to your first inkling okay and don't second guess that and if you catch yourself like make, coming up with something right and then later down the later on in the day you're like wait but what if i do it like this don't do it like that stay with the first thought okay because that's your mind trying to perfect the idea that you already have but the idea that you already have is good okay all right, Virgos, all that I have for you. I hope this helped. Have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive.